how you want. The theme of my project is tarot cards. I was inspired by interacting with people in their everyday lives. When I talk to my friends or classmates, or when I interact with new acquaintances, we talk about many different topics. I gradually found that among all the different topics, Divination is a common topic that uh, some people talk about. Some people are interested in divination games. For example, horoscope reading, gospel telling, tarot reading. I think this is a very interesting phenomenon and uh, an interesting topic. I hope to be able to look more deeply into tarot divination and a uh, topic for uh, projects. First, I created a mind map by diffusion, my thinking around the divination as a source of inspiration. Based on the ba basic mind map, I began to do some initial diffusion research. I looked into the origins of divination, its history, its presentation, and the reality these plants, such as social sociology and uh, psychology. From my initial research, I identified five keywords that interested me the most: divination, tarot, zodiac, emotions, psychology. And around these five keywords, I conducted the more in depth research. In the course of my research on the historical piece, I found that in history and class, tarot dimension is closely related to Grand mythology. The British Museum is the oldest and the greatest comprehensive museum in the world, with a hard grand co collection funds on the spinlated culture of Greece. So I went to the British Museum's grand gallery to do some field research and to take photographs to record many of the photos related to them. I found some ancient grand artists' faces, some ancient grand, grand Seals used for divination and uh, rituals. There are ancient Greek artifacts used for rituals and uh, divination. These antiques are from the first to seventh centuries and have a long history. However, their appearance, patterns, and the colors are well preserved and they have a strong style and uh, character. This particular pattern and the colors appealed to me, and I used to color my cards to record my feeling in my sketchbook. I experimented with the relief technique to develop, develop the image of my design a uh, second time. The special texture and the delicate touch of relief became a characteristic of the image. At the same time, relief printing allows the image to combine the advantages of vivid colors, distinct and a rich indented feel, which is visually and uh, tactically very different from normal printing. This type of printing is a good representation of the action handmade vividly color features of ancient green pots. In the printing process, due to the nature of relief printing, I get the same pattern every time I do a print, but each time the color will be different. The overlay of different colors and different shapes gave each image and a different color effect. I end up with a new set of image. I gave this to my friends, but each color was different. They were wanted to get the color they liked. So I asked them to pick one at a region without looking at the image. Some got the color they liked best, and some didn't. I found the process is very interesting, and it made me think of a tiny, tiny toy, the blind box. The box contained a virtually of cute dolls, but uh, there was no specific label on the box. Based on the toy elements in the blue light box, I went to the toy museum and uh, researched picture of some of the toy elements we are obtained. The psychology, show, psychological research had shown that uh, um, certain stimuli, stimuli uh, reinforce, reinforce respite dissociation, so the blind box uh, suddenly became addic addictive. However, According to my subject keyword, divination research shows that people become more superstitious when faced with the stress of the unknown and are therefore more likely to turn to divination and other superstitious methods to solve their problems. I have discovered some new connections. The tarot divination game and the blind box game both have uncertainty and the unknown. I see a lot of symmetries between the ancient game of tarot and the modern trendy toy games of the blind box. Where and the blind box are like symbols of the past and the present. People say psychology show uh, stimulation and uh, comfort in the face of stress and uh, the unknown, both in the past and in the present. I will continue to dive deep, deep, deep into tarot and the blind box. Firstly, I researched the, the history and organs of tarot cards in different cultures and the graphic design of tarot cards by different artists. During this stage of my research, I collected many references to images from different styles and apparels, which I created and I used the, the, in different ways to create the new image. 
After obtaining the new image, I created a second design of the image using relief and action. However, after completing the printing, I realized that the way it was printed out was no suitable for the correction of my subject because I indented to design a full set of tarot cards. I had a larger workload for the graphic design aspect of this tarot deck. I did not think that relief and action were the appropriate muscles. Where these muscles can provide special textures and effects. They have limitations in terms of color and efficiency. For example, I could not use too many colors in relief and the, I could not use action to complete the 36 images I had planned as it would take too long. So, I continued with other research on the subject and I hoped that I could find a new skills in image stars more research. So I started my research for the keywords Zodiac, which is an important element in the tarot. I found the famous poster work in the uh, illustrator Mocha Zodiac. In the research I have completed, I have been given many new images. I observed that these images have rich and vivid colors. In terms of nature, appreciation, and the social activities, color is objectively stimulating and uh, symbolic to people. I carried out some research on color and the uh, psychology of color. For them was the first symbol leap to emerge in the 20th century with a strong painting steels and steel and the blood, bright colors. The steel of printing was characterized by wild colors and the martial impact. It was used to plant blood and strong colors, such as red, blue, greens, and yellows. They have absorbed the expressions of primitive African Polynesia, Central and the South America art, using simple line and the block of color to express their strong emotions. I plan to conduct an, an in-depth study of color and the color's uh, safe ecology with reference to the color of the wood school plan steel. People, people become more superstitious when faced with stress or the unknown and are therefore more likely to seek out what is seen as superstitious means of solving problems, such as diminution in my research I found on the relationship between Carter's card, diminution, and the people's everyday reality the psychological problems. There are my summaries and the presentations of Project 1 and Project 2. In my next project research, I plan to continue to dig into my ongoing theme of tarot diminution in relation to people's everyday reality psychological problems. In terms of in-depth research into the mean, Meaning of the third day, I plan to read more books and uh, literature on the subject in written form. form. For example, the ecology, definition, the ecology graph comes from different periods. In the case of the tarot, the major icon, which, which is by far the far most widely uh, used tarot card, will be the main force of this study. I need to record and uh, summarize the relevant information and the word picture from this textual material and find new connections and develop more deeper means about the tarot and the, the such side from it. On the virtual side, the design of virtual image of tarot card is also very important. Many artists have designed the tarot card a motifs in ancient and modern times, and there are different graphic interpretations of the same card means. There are nearly a hundred designs on the market, and each artist has a different uh, pro coach pro edge to the deck. I plan to collect the reference to various artists' tarot design to analyze their examples and to observe and learn from the characteristics and the strengths of these examples. In my own work, I hope to try interpret the meaning of this card in my own pictorial style and the character. The tarot card uh, motifs are related to the culture, religion, or folk art of the time. So I would like to study the tarot card motifs and the realities materials in artworks in the chrono a chronological order to investigate the relationship between the tarot card and the people's uh, psychological problems, so that my theme is protected by more materials. Finally, I plan to be able to design an entirely new set of tarot cards. Once my research is fully completed, I hope that the visual image of this new set of tarot cards, such as colors and the patterns, will present and the of which range of visuals with a strong personal touch after uh, throws and uh, in-depth research. The tarot card will also have modern humans to improve their uh, mental stress and uh, psychological problems, both virtually and in them of their use, so that people can feel happy and uh, well-pleased. I'm finished. Thank you.